Today we're going to be talking about sub-elements in Avatar The Last Airbender, specifically firebending. The first sub-element we're going to be taking a look at is lightning. This sub-element was an extremely rare skill with one of the original users being killed off by Avatar Kiyoshi. It was rediscovered by the Fire Nation centuries later and reserved for the royal family. However, after the Hundred Year War, it has become more common as you see more people using it in The Legend of Korra. It's known as the Cold-Blooded Fire and it's done by separating the positive and negative energies and releasing them out of your fingertips. The next sub-element we're going to be taking a look at is Combustion Bending. This is an extremely rare sub-element with only two known users, Plea and Sparky Sparky Boom Man. This sub-element allows the user to blow stuff up with their mind, and all the combustion users are denoted by the third eye tattoo on their forehead. It's an extremely powerful and dangerous skill done by focusing the energy on one singular point, such as the third eye tattoo. This sub-element can be extremely dangerous to the user as well as it led to both of their deaths. And we've also seen the potential of the ray that's being fired out to be curved mid-air by Plea. Can't forget about lightning redirection. And before you say it's a sub-element, he's just removing heat from the volcano. 